Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode here on Passage of Skin. It's absolutely a pleasure to have you. Thank you very much for joining us. It's good to see you again. Today, we're playing the demo of South Park, Fractured Butthole. All the fractured ass. All the fractured ass. That uh, it's something man could ever have in his entire life. All in the cartoony goodness of South Park. Now, Stick of Truth was actually a really enjoyable game. I uh, just never actually ended up um, finishing it off. It was one of those games I actually played with my friend. Like a friend was playing it, and I was sitting kibitzing over his shoulder while he was playing it. And I was like, right, I'll, I'll get around to this at some point. I'll probably play it. But uh, no. Instead, I end up actually just leaving it by the wayside. Tempted by Fractured But Whole, especially with the fact that you get a remastered version of Stick of Truth 3 with it. But um, yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. The, the fact that we're essentially just getting an extra, what, season? Two seasons of South Park just as an animated game form. It's pretty cool, but the only problem I actually have with the um, South Park game series is that it reminds me so, so much of the first two parts of the Rain Slick Precipice of Darkness, which was done by Penny Arcade, which was a kind of uh, fantasy reimagining characters wandering in a world. You know, South Park does it with its particular brand of humor. Penny Arcade did it with uh, its particular brand of writing. Thank you for playing. Continue your superhero adventures and save South Park. Mm, no thanks. What? Does that let me play the demo? What the fuck, man? That is balls. I literally just downloaded it. So did the trial start counting from the moment I downloaded the damn game? That is a big pile of balls. So I'm gonna try this on a different, I'm gonna try this a different way, hang on. Switch user. I need to actually close the game out first. So I'm gonna try and play this on another profile. Pretty sure it was actually my American one that actually has that had the purchase of that on it. Maybe that'll actually stop it from uh, freaking out because it said you tell me like, oh, you can't share it between people or share it between accounts or you can't get to play it more than once. So I'm like, all right, fine, I get you, I get you, I can understand that. Maybe this time it'll actually let me play it on this profile. Hmm. Should we start again? I do not think so. It's not installing. Uh, the error was actually coming up because uh, this is a trial, this is a demo, but I downloaded it on my American account, but I was trying to play it on my UK account because I play everything on my UK account. So I'm taking a look to see if the American account will still allow me to actually log in. Problems with technology, guys. It always happens. Revolutionary Odyssey system. <laughs> That's exactly what it is. It wouldn't let me do the trial because I was on my other account that I actually I didn't purchase this demo one. That's absolutely fine. Cool, we got ourselves ready to rock and roll. That's good to learn. Sometimes demos do lock like that. They only lock to a particular uh, profile that you download them with. It makes complete utter sense. Right, that's us rocking and rolling. Merch. Super streamer starter kit. What? <laughs> so they actually have a Twitch fucking building. Uh, not Twitch Prime member. I am a Twitch Prime member, motherfuckers. <laughs> All right. So yeah, you need to actually have a Twitch account and all that kind of crack. All right, so uh, that was a bit weird to look at. Um, well, I'll skip all of that for the moment. We're going straight into the trial that's available for the game. Um, I'm looking forward to actually playing this because if it actually is a, um, if it's a decent trial, then I'm I'm much more tempted to actually purchase the full game. But just someone that actually, I think the the loss of the demo world, like actually like demos for games, being a lot less now. Oh, dude, it actually just opens like an episode too. I don't think I've ever actually seen the opening whenever I was actually playing with friends.
The adventure begins. <laughs> I'm instantly American, man. Of course I am. How do you think I actually managed to get this profile in the first place? Ubisoft Osaka. So if this was animated by a Japanese animation company, does this make this anime? Ah, snuffles. Grumbles, sorry. Damn it. What has become of this city? There used to be love. This shitty. Justice. Shitty walk. Not anymore. Cram is out of control. Cats are missing, and townspeople are being victimized. Oh, hey, who pooped on my porch? What's going on with you? Whoa, whoa. <laughs> we'll always do that. We were supposed to protect those who God couldn't damn protect kid. themselves. Get off my Coons porch, pooping on porches. Now superheroes are torn apart by political differences. We are two sides at war. <laughs> but war isn't going to save our city. Time travel is my only hope now. What? Myths tell of ancient times. When a new king united a kingdom torn apart by a powerful stick. Hi, hon. Shut up, man. There's no time to waste. I have to go back, change the present if I can, and find this cat. And in doing so, perhaps I can change what has happened to all of us. I do like the actual the, the explanation for their like why they're playing this game now with the superheroes rather than actually their fantasy one. It's it's it's, a, it's actually a charming premise. All right, so they're obviously going to get us to actually do the basic uh, design of characters. Um, I'm going to be bald as I always am. Oh, see, the problem is I always play girls in games. If I see a hair that I actually like, then I'm going like, oh, I'll do that one. Otherwise, I'll go bald me. Yeah, I'll do the job. Right. Oh shit, there's actually a proper deep purple there. I was actually looking there and going like, oh, there's no purple. Ah, I can actually go with red. Ginger kids. Right, so what else are we going with? Makeup. Uh, harder, do we? Hmm. Can't tell the makeup, can't see the difference. Makeup this facial hair. Ah, oh, no, screw it. Actually, if they if they they're doing facial hair, screw it. I'm going as myself. As like what normally I do play as girls in games, but a bearded kid wandering around the city is going to be perfect. Oh no, that's not the Avengers logo. That's the Avengers font. They can buy the font. <laughs> they can cheat the color of my bald head. All right. <laughs> ah, I thought I was actually going to be able to do the tint of the glasses. That'd be kind of nice. <coughs> Excuse me. Give me the basic stuff. Uh, so what am I wearing? I'm wearing a blue shirt today, so we're gonna go with blue. And on my hands, there's absolutely nothing. It is like saying easy or hard, but I'm actually yeah, I'm gonna choose my skin tone, so <laughs> let's see how easy it actually is. The lonely land is sad back. 
Shinjin Zarong. <laughs> the Moorish are attacking! There's Moorish everywhere! Don't let them get to our base! It's too late! They've taken Koopa Kick! Ah. Fellas, they got the base! You gotta stop him! Spike the Moorish! Their armor is too strong! They're wearing bicycle helmets! Where is the king? I'm just sitting relaxing. I'm on my throne. <laughs> I need to have a throne. <laughs> Classy. Truly classy, South Park. Deuce Master! And opening that one? No. Touch all the things. made friends in this town so quickly. We came here to hide. More friends just means more trouble. You're being paranoid. You need to lay off that stuff. It's changing you. Oh, lay off. It's the one thing that helps me relax from your stupid shit. Oh, hey, whippersnapper. Yay. You there. Your friends are downstairs, kiddo. Get out there and play. <laughs> <laughs> I want to blaze it in my winning. Ah. Me do that. Touch all the things. That's what gonna do. Oh, all right. <laughs> Everything I need to grab or anything I could grab. Yeah, pretty much. Good ground. Is that loading? Yeah, I was actually wondering if that was actually loading, but it's not. It's just pretty normal right now. Click all the things. Click all the things. <laughs> Mommy, stop crying, sweetheart. I just have something stuck in my eye. That's okay, Mom. It's alright. I'm just here to raid the fridge, take all the stuff, and uh, then uh, head out to my friends. Yay, a little bit of money. My lord, the filthy Moorish are attempting to overtake Koopa Keep. You better get back, my liege. You are our only hope. Are they the Koopa Troopas then? You just moved to town, and you get to be king? Well, I think you're a little pussy. Punch that more in the face, king! Yeah, he can't talk to you like that! Go, king, go! Teach him a lesson, my lord! Knock him okay. out, king! <clears throat> uh, king's blue. <laughs> Bird would not back and cause extra damage to enemies by knocking them into other enemies. Allies are all their objects. Well, it makes sense. I'm not afraid of you and your strategic king combos. Ha! <laughs> Our king is undefeatable. Okay, really hit him this time, king. Boom! And he's dead. We can't stop him. Ready the guards of the dark court. Wow! Did you see that? The king's amazing. Can't take us all on. Yeah, just walk away. Yeah, I'm not walking away from this stuff. <laughs> right. Uh, okay, so I said you basically the, the, the timeline is just active time battle, so what you mean? You so I'm not really there. I don't see changes.
Boom, knock him back. Oh, the humanity. It's fine, they're the bad guys. Oh yeah, go king! Oh man, he's still not dead. <laughs> Your king's too powerful. Down you go. Lego breaks blocking the doorway. You Very effective. Can't. Oh yeah, why not? Because everything in front of here is lava. Oh, dude, no way. All that is lava? Yeah, everything from here to here is lava. You can't cross it. Shit! Come on, let's get inside. We can't. They're seeing everything in front of the door is lava. Oh, that's not fair. What do we do, the king? What do you do now? You die. Really? The dragon! <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Dragon time. No way. That's the dragon roaring. It's pissed. <laughs> this is what I want they're going to do with that. Oh, nice. Achievement unlocked. We are the Dragon Slayer. Oh my god, he defeated the dragon! No freaking way! That kid's amazing! Maybe there's a way in through the garage, my lord! If there's a way in through the garage, the king will hide it. Yes, only the king can find the secret way in through the garage. If, if there is one. Yeah, only the king with his infinite wisdom and strength can get past this impassable barrier. Go ahead, your highness. Use your unparalleled intellect to figure out a way in. Well, King Douchebag is such a skillful warrior. Did you see how he moved that ladder and used it to climb up? <laughs> yeah. Is it? But you are such a brown nose. I 
thought the king was going to do a sweet jump, but then he just did that. You're dead. <laughs> Nice somersault. Big bard, what happened to the stick of truth? The wizard had it thrown into the ocean. Lies, you shall feel the wrath of the Moorish. Unhand him, you heathens. Release the bard or you'll have the king to deal with. The king? They say he can slay a dragon with one blow. That's right. And if you don't... Uh, wait, wait, whoa, where is the wizard? Uh, I thought he was with you guys. Now we got a distress signal to come help him here. <laughs> Wizard is gone. My name is the King. I'm from the future. Dude, we said we're not playing that anymore. Yeah, we're all split up. What's the point? This is the point. In my time, there is a massive crime wave and missing cats. I knew my only hope was to assemble the team. Hey, you can't switch games like this. Where's the stick of truth? Shut up, Kevin. This isn't about some dumb stick. There's a cat in trouble, and it's the key to finding the crime syndicate new to our town. In the future. Crime syndicate? That's... That sounds too heavy for Coon and friends. Well, what do you want, Clyde? You want the fucking Freedom Pals to find the missing cat? Get the hundred dollar reward and make their superhero franchise more popular? Fuck the Freedom Pals, dude. That's right. Oopsikins! There's a loud ringing coming from your basement playroom. The Coon Alert! Come on, Coon friends! Go get your stuff and report back to the Coon Lair! In the future, Coon and friends, the symbol! Sorry, guys, you can't play with us. We're playing superheroes now, and you guys are dorks. <laughs> <laughs> All the preparation. It's a little bit sad. Ow! Zuck Phasers for Flambe! Well, nothing left to do but go home and play Star Trek Bridge Crew. <laughs> just grab from there. I'm just gonna take a wee wandering. Some shit to steal. Some shit to punch. <laughs> Big Legend is hardcore. Yeah, man. We got this. This is the hardcore some shit. So challenging. We could all go to my house and sit around, staring. I'm bummed. I was gonna take up a trade, learn how to fletch arrows. It's whenever people get really into D&D, &D, they start talking about oh, craftsmanship. Hello. The boys are down in their little basement playroom. Eric and his friends are so imaginative. Coon cakes. So it said you Robin all the stuff like, but I don't know the password for it yet. Oh, did you get locked out? I'm afraid little Eric put a lock on the door to keep me out. I'm sure he has the passcode written down here somewhere. Yeah, I'm just gonna check upstairs in his room. So, a little bit of exploratory, kind of like guy finding the things that we need. It's gonna be a picture of him being awesome, I imagine. Like, well, he, what he thinks is being awesome. Probably a picture of the drum of his dick in uh, Potter's Mouth. I'm pretty sure that's what's going to be the one. <laughs> uh, drone GS4 hoverboard. Using the shit list. Hell, Mom, Clyde, David. Oof, PC pricing. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> An open coon only. Right. Thank you, man! <laughs> Literally, fuck you, Mom. the hell is in here? It's like, <laughs> I'm trying to see all the meme references that are all on that at the same time. Tokens life matters. Election did. They literally just memorabilia for absolutely everything, including his green costume as well then. So at least we have the door. That's also sorted. Hit the kitty. Vibrator found? Yep, that's imagine exactly what it was. Crack stallion butt plug? Yep, knew there was gonna be something of that sort.
There we go. Pitch it up, and it's safe. So different toilets will have different prizes. That was actually like a difficulty check of three. I'm like, why was it actually necessary? Just give me a full detailed explanation of how he was pinching it off. Matt and Dre Parker, you guys have got Somebody way too much time on your hands. put lava in front of my door. Well, no, it's not hot, but my son told me I will burn to death if I try and cross it. Fuck. Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, yes, he did tell me that if I no. step on a crack, it would break my mother's back. It won't. know anything that's not enough mosquito we have to act fast before the freedom pals can a hundred dollar reward do you know what that could mean to our superhero franchise that cat looks pretty old maybe he just died in the gutter somewhere human kite do i have to remind you that as of right now freedom pals have a hundred followers on instagram mm. we have six the five of us and billy turner who's a ginger this is the key to finally beating those fuckers but where do we start looking that cat could be anywhere we need to split up mosquito Take to the air and check out all the city parks. You got it. Mosquito away. Human kite, see if the cat is stuck up a tree somewhere. You've got the storm drain, Super Craig. Super Craig. Fast pass, I need you to use your superhuman speed to get to the mayor's office and tell her we're on the case. Don't worry, Coon. You can count on fast pass to get there fast. Fast. <laughs> Give me <clears throat> the coon store. Buy all the coon toys. Buy all the coon goods. <laughs> the franchise plan. <laughs> Those are actually references. The ones that have probably been cancelled along the way here. <laughs> the new Assassin's Creed game. No, that's not, man. I ended up, uh, I did start playing the Sonic Forces game earlier on. I was playing, it was a Sonic Forces demo that actually just came out. But, hey, um... Hey, hey, Do not touch that! That device can blow up the entire Milky Way galaxy! Jesus, fuck! Mom! The new kid is trying to play with the cube of ultimate destruction! You be nice to all your friends, Eric. Be a good sharer. Good sharer? It'll blow up the fucking galaxy! Stupid bitch! Look, dude, we already told you, you can't play. You aren't a superhero. You don't have a costume. You don't have any superpowers. Uh, all right, look, you can watch us play superheroes as long as you don't get in the way. Make yourself you. Never seen the coon cycle up close, huh? Well, I've never seen someone so bad at finding a Stephanie the best. That's our holding cell for supervillains. Why would we keep a supernity device in there? You seriously can't find the supernity device? A superheroes use inspection mode, you know. There we go. <clears throat> find the thing that we're looking for. Well, that took long enough. Supernity device active. <laughs> really want to be a superhero, huh? Play with the big boys? <sighs> well, maybe. Maybe you can be useful. Have a seat at the table, douchebag. Let's see, mosquitoes, ABLs. Jesus Christ, are these even in a human language? And the questionnaire begins. Who are we? You have to have a new job's going persona. great, guys. Thanks very much yeah, for asking. It's been <clears throat> about three weeks, so I'm you have getting probably page? settled in. Oh boy, you're not even on Instagram, huh? Well, I guess I can create one for you. Fucking unbelievable. Let's see. So the first thing we need to fill out on your character sheet is your class, Speedster. Since you're a newbie, you can only choose between three for now. Brutalist. Blaster. Blaster with range powers like Cyclops. I'm going Blaster. Okay, douchebag, but now we need to find out what terrible thing in your past drives you. You see, douche, all superheroes have a compelling backstory. It's from that backstory that their powers gain meaning. Let's take you back to when you were just a child. Hmm. You lay awake that night. Like so many other nights, you couldn't sleep because you knew you weren't like the other kids. 
You walked to the mirror. You walked to the mirror. You looked in the mirror and you felt alone. And that's when it happened. A loud noise. You swore you could hear your mother calling for help. You left your room. I'm not going to try and piss you off Cartman with this. I just want to get through it as fast as possible, them, really. Your parents. You knew you had the power to stop them, so for the first time, you called upon your blaster powers. As a blazing blaster hero, you began to overheat as the fire in your belly ignited. You wasted no time delivering sick burns into the villains before you. As the flames cleared, the intruders realized what they were up against. Shit, this little flamer means business! <laughs> Did your mom tell you not to play with fire? The intruders moved in to attack. Ow. You've left us no choice, kid. Crouch oh, oh, oh. fire. With the enemies closing in, you gave yourself some space by knocking your foes back. Uppercut. But the intruders wouldn't take getting pushed around lightly. Hey, you can't push us around like that. Right, that's towards the percentage for your actual special. <laughs> Little did they know, they set themselves up for destruction. Get out of the way. His comrade fallen. The extra ugly one closed in. Ultimate so ready. Now, you little flamer. Yeah, we showed him. You were great ultimate but the destruction. Fires the burn within you. you swallowed the pain and unleashed your ultimate attack. <laughs> always, always with the farts. And so you beat them. All seemed to be okay. But then you finally reached your parents' door. And what you saw when you opened that door changed your life forever and led you to fighting crime. You were too late. Because when you opened that door, you saw... You saw your dad fuck your mom. <laughs> wow. That's a tragic... That's a pretty heavy backstory. You fight crime tragic, because scary you never backstory. forgot the night you weren't in time. You saw your ones. own father, the man you trusted. Fuck your mom. It's like a ripple in time you can't ever change, isn't it? All right. Now that you're a superhero, I have a mission for you. I need you to go out into town and try to get as many followers as you can on Coonstagram. It's the only way our franchise will survive. Okay. Costumes installed. Huh. Ah, oh, it's falling down the apps for it. Right, I get you now. Harder sheets. <laughs> New inventory available at the Kingston. <clears throat> New inventory available. <clears throat> All components. Eh. So what's this? Mm. <clears throat> are these just craftable materials for making stuff? Like food degree? All right. And scrap, and these are particularly for. If you are not a registered member of Cunin Friends, please exit the Kunin items. Now. Okay, so we got forty-five cents. How much we got? Oh, recipes. Ah, those are useful, but expensive. I have nowhere near enough to actually buy anything. Now, so we're good for the moment. Let's go with our defaults. Yeah. Well, 
Isn't this fun? Oh, wonderful. I'll see you on the internet. <laughs> it is going odd to actually have older people just going like, I'll see you on the web. Uh, hey, yeah, that's true, actually. We all see each other on the web, though. Instagram? <clears throat> I'm curious how far this trial actually goes, because so far it's actually kind of like done your basic introduction stuff. I imagine there's not going to be that much more than this to actually continue on. No one is actually just find other people. When I go home, I'm gonna play Star Trek VR and it's gonna be awesome. Yeah. I can't be in a photo with someone with so few followers. Sorry. <clears throat> That's only the kids are actually not gonna worry about it. Can you help me with this thing? It's stuck. I'm I'm busy, kid. Hey, you, you got it open. You're the real deal, little superhero. Hey, you, you got it open. You're the real deal, little superhero. A, a selfie? Sure, kid, let's do it. <clears throat> it's a mentally nice. dumb mechanic. It really is. Okay, I guess you're popular enough to selfie with. Okay, I guess you're popular enough to selfie with. We're friends now, I guess. <laughs> Since anybody who actually has complained about the fact that they didn't want to do a selfie well, with me, I'm going to just give them a shit selfie. selfie. I think that's what it is. I think it's just the hub and them a couple of side quests to play with. So assuming this is where we actually pull out the map. Yep. Right, meet Cal at his house. So, pen is like the mission? And I can't really play with any of the rest of the stuff. It's not letting me. <clears throat> Do I need to go east? Yeah. Okay. Long traversal as you run from place to place. Who would do such a thing? It's just so mean. Hey, kid, you know what Randy. I mean about this? Somebody's keying my wife's car at night. It's happening every night. I thought it was just one of you damn kids, but we'll... Here, come here, take a look at this. That's so plots have been so plots. My car is also leaving notes. I'm just scared it's a jilted lover or something. You won't forget me that easy. I thought we had something. I'll tell the world about you, bitch. Listen, I'm sick of having to buff this shit out. If you can catch whoever's keying my wife's car tonight, I'll follow you on Coonstagram. Trust me, you want me as a follower. I'm a pretty big deal in this town. <laughs> ah, I see you've made it to the Palace of the Clouds. That's home base, human kite. Perhaps you can find him inside. Yeah, kitty. Oh shit, I've gone too far. I was on the wrong side of the tracks. Yeah, this is where I need to be. Wait, I thought I was actually having to go further. The 
be responsible putting it back where it needs to be. <laughs> I can do that door. Uh, door in there for a second. Digging the pockets, grabbing all the things that we need. And now taking another massive douche. behind this door. I can't fight him for obvious reasons, you know, alternative universe paradox shit. So you are going to have to take him out. You've got to really kick his ass, dude, so that he wants to return back to his universe on the East Coast. You ready? All right, go get him. Oh, hey, Kyle. I'm big. <laughs> Who's your friend? Did he come to play with us? All right, me from another universe. It is time for you to go back to your universe. What do you mean, Kyle? We're a team, remember? I'm not from another universe. We're like best super pals. <laughs> As you can see, he is the one running around giving the human kite a bad name. He was sent here to destroy me and weaken my power. <laughs> no, I came to two weeks with my cousin and wanted to play superheroes. And then he said, okay, what superhero do you want to be? And I said, I want to be human kite. But he said, you can't be human kite. I'm human kite. And I said, well, why can't we be human kites together? So I went to Aunt Sheila and I said, I want to be human kites together. And she told him he had to do what I said because I was the guest. Remember? I'm sorry, me from another universe, but it is time for you to learn that playing superheroes is too painful. New kid, you must now destroy my alter ego. Oh, Jesus, we're gonna fight? That's right. If you really want to play, then this is how you do it. Well, all right. Anything to make me and my cousin more alike. Prepare for battle, weakling. <laughs> more combat tutorials, because that's a great idea. I haven't done a whole lot of sparring. Is this a no contact thing? Full contact, not sparring. Oh, I'm afraid that's impossible. I didn't bring my pads. It's happening. Get him, new kid. Cousin Kyle, we can beat him if we join forces. Yeah, I really want to, but parallel universe rules say I can't. I'm getting a little tingle in my throat. Does anyone have a lozenge? Oh my, there's a lot of decisions in this game, aren't there? You cannot play. That's a decision you could make. Oh, don't be silly. Oh, you guys, time out. My vertigo is starting to act up. Jesus, come on, dude. <laughs> hey, take it easy, Tiger. I bruise very easily. Okay, I think my inner ear fluids have stabilized now. Uh, that last hit didn't count, right? I'm undoing that damage, okay, Kyle? <laughs> <sighs> That's some classic alternate universe bullshit. Didn't your parents tell you not to play with fire because look what's happening now? Hold on, I need a timeout so I can use my inhaler. But yeah, um, asking about uh, Code Vein. I actually saw the trailer for Code Vein, or Vine, Vine, Vein, Vein, whenever it actually was um, first announced. And I actually I got into, uh, it said you look like a, a Dark Souls with an anime kind of slant over the top of it, which was pretty entertaining. I'm not making it up, it's totally canon in my alternate universe. <laughs> Phew. Does anyone have hydro 
cortisone cream, preferably prescription strength. Wait, I thought I should get this turn instead of the new kid because he didn't wait when I said time out earlier, so I think it should be my turn now. Are you kidding me? That's totally cheating. That wasn't too hard, right? I don't want to cause any permanent damage. I think you sprained my nose. All right, here we go. My super ultimate power. Get ready. Are you ready? Oh, Jesus. Okay, Wrath Kite from an alternate universe. And self damage. <laughs> oh, oh, Jesus. I think I might have ruptured my hernia. You had enough alternate me? Yeah, the superhero stuff really hurts. I better go back to my universe. Oh, you're leaving? Dude, that sucks. Yeah, I'll be going back to my universe now, human kite. I need some camphophonic for my ear because I got a scrape on it by being farted on. Dude, I don't know how to thank you. From now on, call on me whenever you need help. Combat buddy is locked. You now have human kite on your side. Okay, yeah, just two heroes hanging out. Hero time. <clears throat> I'm going to be here for a while. Steal all the things. Nice. <laughs> Just all of the... Again, memorabilia for each character. It's kind of nice to actually spot inside the rooms. Chewbacca is a Wookiee. Ike is awesome. Let's take a picture. Tweaking Craig's steam surprise. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> is there a collectathon for actually like tweaking Craig stuff? New follower? What, did we have a new follower there? Sorry, man. I actually didn't even realize it when we were actually doing the video. It might as well the noise it was. It could have actually been the bus picking up stuff or it could have actually been a new follower on the channel. Oh yeah, no, there's a couple of guys, um, but nobody actually in the last week, we found or so. <clears throat> I apologize for the lack of actual talking during this episode as much, because um, I want to be just like bantering as I normally am, but my throat is fucking killing me, so um, <laughs> I'll do everything I can to actually like, articulate how I'm feeling about this game so far, but I'm not massively impressed, but... It's not, it's not a, an evolution from the previous game, it is just a... My name's Honey Boo Boo. It's, it's just a, a continuation. It really does feel like that. Right, so we got anything Tonight, we need to investigate whoever's this. Whoever's doing this shit is waiting till dark. Yeah, going into this guy, going into Randy's house. I sure miss my dog Patches and that slobbery happy face. Patches would have gotten me condoms. Ah. I need a Jimmy from my Peter, Billy. Can you get me a condom? Hi, turd. Bye, turd. No way, turd. Your follower count is way too top. Fuck you, Shelly. Clear up the cabinets. Take all the things. And the marker we get a maker completely forgot about that. Wasting away in Margaritaville. Goddamn smart ass. Oh, get up. Stan, get your That's Shelly, it's Wendy, isn't it? Uh, that's what it was. 
Damn it. I really forgetting characters' names whenever I'm doing this as well. Thing about the geography of all the rooms, that's one of the things that they actually probably put so much time into to actually really realize it as a uh, make South Park a proper town. Very little of her stuff to actually steal. <laughs> Hope you brought me something good, Billy. Your grandpa's not getting any younger, Billy. I need those rubbers. Ain't gonna be any younger, and he's still gonna actually keep on getting more fucking pussy than me. So where am I meant to be going now? I'm gonna take a look at these other option screens, actually. Ha! Ah! So essentially it's anything that actually has multiple slots, I imagine. Uh, club exclusives? Pfft. Be brief. I mean, you'd be so- So it's like club exclusives, they're kind of like, right. Alright, cool, at least I can actually make a little bit of modification to this. Boom, that makes sense. Yeah, this really does. I, I was actually thought it was a, like stats were affected by this, but it's not. It's actually just the uh, character design. So, um, yeah. You can change yourself at any time you feel like. Makes sense. So, titles. What have we got here? Alright, so we've actually covered those titles. Ah, right, so essentially it just shows what allies we actually have. It doesn't really do anything other than that. The character sheets are for people that I haven't met yet, but it, no, I can understand that. Right. So since you just look in there, what everything was, <laughs> it feels like I'm actually I'm playing the earliest parts of this game. Lots of places are kind of locked off, but maybe I'll just continue on to the next mission. Do mission in tray. Do mission list. That's what we need. The scavenger hunts. Randy mysteries. All right. So blue things are actually the main plot. So I'm just going to grab those and go through the main stuff. I'm not too concerned about them. Um, other things, I suppose. I mentioned that map. Way to the left. Yeah, so we're going to change the Super Craig. Mm, can't ask them if they want to have a selfie. Just random person in the background. Wait, can you open up every- oh, you can open up every guard? Jesus Christ. It's like just raiding through people's houses for absolutely everything. You have to bring someone with you to be able to actually get this to actually springboard you up or anything? Grab 
grab someone and drag it there. But I'm trying to think of what it could be that you could drag. Oh well. Imagine you actually get more stuff later on. So what about these houses that are actually there? Can you get into them? You can go into every house. Jesus. Wait, this is my house? Yeah? Hey, Mom. <laughs> yeah, just check out the buttons to see if there was anything different that I was actually not using previously. So, keep having left. Just left. All the way left. Look out, Butt Lord. Those are sixth graders. They're the most vile, evil beings known to superheroes. You guys are stupid. Everyone knows Keeper's mom has the nicest boobs. Dude, shut up about my mom's boobs, bro. Why don't you make me zit face? You guys want to go to the movies? There might be some boobs in Wonder Woman. Movies are dumb. Let's go shoot some hoops. Basketball's stupid, bro. Hey, hey. When I finish kicking your butt, I'm gonna kick your stupid frog butt. Frogs don't have butts, they have claw attacks. Ah, nice kick. Punch him in the back of the skull. <laughs> So immediately burn because no matter what, it's going to always be the. the bully. Ah, it's a bit, there is a bit of time into it. I'm still the bully. Ah. Ew, stop. Hot pants. Protective kite. Shut up, wuss. Yes, that was awesome. I can't say no to kicking. <laughs> oh, I'm up. Okay. You pure laser vision. And you may want to actually put out that fire on your balls. Wow. There is a big difference between the actual normal hit and whenever you kneel it. Um. That made me see stars. For Forthy Scum, you guys are kind of scrappy. You like that, Forthy? Got a lot more waiting for you in middle school. Forecast 100% chance of kite attack. Wow, a bit overkill. Level up. You new kid, a bully of the bullies. You really want a selfie with me? Not Peter Mon. Watching you defeat that sixth grader was so cool. Maybe I can become as strong as you one day. Also locked? No, uh, not locked. Hello there, neighbor. You know you, you don't live here, right? Would be you helped Jimmy out with this little project first. Yeah. 
help Jimmy finish up big project and sure I can selfie. Continuing the pillaging of everyone's homes. Collect all the items and make something. The hell? Jimmy, what are you building? The cosmic treadmill so we can go back in time again? Keep it growing. I'll keep gassing up. <laughs> so it was actually a time trial. Right. So I thought it was actually just one of those things where you just kind of kept playing until there was a certain point. But they literally just gave you an hour of time trial. Alright. You kind of got me. You got me, South Park. I'm interested. I'm going to pick it up. The, the charm is actually in the play. It's actually in the actual fact that the game has a lot of humor on its side. I'm... I can't... I can't not... Pick it up. So, um, well, the way it says for the South Park, Park Fracture Put Hole with the American Prizes because I'm actually on my American store to be able to actually be able to play this because the trial is only, was only available on the American um, PSN network. I've enjoyed playing through this. I actually, I, I'm, I'm, I'm enraptured by it. I'm actually like really, really focused on the playing. I'm actually kind of, uh, enjoying a, just a, a South Park adventure game. The Stick of Truth was enjoyable to watch a little bit, but I suppose. I mean, I just, I connect more with uh, superheroes and sci-fi than I actually do with fantasy. So Stick of Truth didn't hold my attention, but this actually still uh, caught my attention. So if I actually go and pick this game up, I will probably be playing through Stick of Truth and then immediately afterwards playing through Fractured But Whole. So uh, if you guys would like to see more of that on the channel, if you would like to see me doing my playthrough of the game, uh, obviously I probably have a lot more to say, especially whenever I have a much healthier voice and not really hurting quite so bad. But yeah, um, South Park was really enjoyable and I'm looking forward to actually seeing a bit more of it. So guys, thank you very much for watching. If you happen to be watching this on the YouTube, uh, well, the only thing I have to say is there's a button up there. I'd really appreciate it if you actually hit the button up there. Super, super cool if you do. And if you don't hit that button, then please make sure to hit any of the other ones, the likes, the shares and whatever else is actually be pretty cool. Matter on whatever source it is you actually happen to see this on. Up in the top up there, there will be actually a playlist button, or not a playlist button, a playlist that will actually be cold opens, all the games that I've looked at here on the channel. Over on the far side will be the most recent video on the channel, and right here will be a video just for you, based on the user analytics and the things you do on YouTube and the things you actually sit down and watch. It will be a video that you will enjoy, so I highly recommend that you check that one out. It is actually designed for you. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye.